You know anything about guns? Sure. My grandpa used to take me hunting when I was a kid. I also took a class on firearms. This bad boy can settle a few old scores. Check it out. Careful, it's loaded. <laughs> you keep it loaded? Yeah. You never know when you may need to use it. Oh, easy, sweetie. Todd here almost fired his gun. My ultimate fantasy. Two men preparing to duel over me. Well, it's no contest. See, uh, I'm much more experienced. Oh, it's close. Oh. Believe me. Cool. It's just like my grandpa's. Yeah, David thinks he's Dick Gatling with all this firepower. He's worried about a home invasion, as if he's a real celebrity. <sighs> Todd said, uh, you mentioned the movie offer. Did I? Perhaps in passing. I don't really remember. I thought we said that topic was closed. No, David, you decided it was closed. I'm not going to discuss this in front of strangers. Todd is no stranger. Yeah, that much is obvious. David, put the gun away. You're drunk. You might shoot someone. You know? From this range, I couldn't miss. I need to go. <laughs> Don't be silly. Mickey wants you here. David, what are you doing? You didn't expect me here, did you? This is getting weird. Oh, I'm sorry. Gonna made you feel uncomfortable. Let's be open about it. I mean, most of us are adults here. I don't understand. What do you mean? It's okay. I saw you too. We can talk about it. Confession is good for the soul. Mickey, tell him he's got it all wrong. Please. What can I say, babe? Dick Gatling's on our case. Do you think that I am a complete idiot? You walk into my house, you criticize my work after screwing my wife. My wife! Oh, you're crazy, man. I've never touched Mickey. Hey, sweetie, your boyfriend here is holding the gun on me. Uh, no way, man. Look, I just want to leave. David, do you know what you're doing? Yes. I know exactly what I'm doing for the first time. You're right. I've been cheating on you. Mickey, what are you doing? You gave me no choice. There's nothing left, David. Why, why stay? You obviously hate me. Do not move. Even though you're washed up as a writer, I still thought you were smart enough to take a fortune when it was offered to you. Is, is money all that you think about? It certainly would make life with you more bearable. Go to hell. Put the gun down, Mr. Graham. Shoot him, Todd. It's the only way we'll be together. Yeah, Todd, shoot, you him, shoot him, Todd! You have the gun to shoot, shoot me! Come now. on, Todd, you're gonna shoot me! You're gonna shoot, shoot me! You're gonna shoot me! Shut shoot up, him. you bitch! Finally, I get to meet Dick Gatling. I think the taste of blood turns me on. Hit me again, Dick. Now, Todd! He was gonna shoot you. He, he moved. You actually had it in you. Oh my God. Oh my God. You think he's dead? He's not sleeping, that's for sure. Oh my, I don't feel good. They're gonna put you in prison. Oh, it'll be a great movie of the week. Will you <laughs> shut up? Jesus, this is your fault. You know, I ought to just... You had to what? Kill me, too? Police, freeze. Drop your weapon. Oh, okay, okay. That I said drop your weapon. You just killed one of my students. But I did not kill one of them. It was still the defense. I put it down. It was... <laughs> Thank you.
This just ain't your day, partner. Damn, that thing is loud. Were you gonna wait till he shot me till you came in the hey, door? Ma you said, make it convincing. Well, I'm convinced. Come here. You think we can sell the movie rights? Guaranteed. Every time I see two lovers, the moonlight hand in hand. I still think about your deep green eyes and all the things we planned. It was bad, bad magic that brought us to this place. The kind of love that jumps into the flame. It was very, very bad magic that brought us. Shadow in the darkened spaces where the spirits come to town. It was bad, bad magic that brought us to this place. The kind of love that jumps into the flame. It was very, very bad magic that brought us face to face. Magic is to blame. I still think of you. Yesterdays, it was just a phase. 